Hey, this is Kevin Bees and uh, Vasara Bees in for tip number 32 on the life-changing business tips. And today is uh, it's actually a really quite enjoyable um, tip to share with you. And the idea or the tip I want to share with you is that you need to have a customer-loving folder. Now, what does that mean uh, to have a customer-loving folder? A customer-loving folder is... As you start doing your work with clients or have you having great results with your clients, they're going to start um, telling you, they're going to start sending you nice messages or, hey, maybe you can see uh, if, you know, particularly like myself, if someone's done something great and then they get an award or they, uh, they follow your instructions and then now they've got press or publicity um, or they've actually just messaged you to say that something that you've done has really helped them. So uh, a couple of examples uh, from this last week or two, uh, one of the clients messaged me to say that just one tip uh, that we had or one conversation that we had across the whole year of the program was worth 10 times his investment, let alone everything else we did, but one, one thing delivered 10 times the value. Uh, or even this week, uh, one of my clients uh, in Switzerland, he just messaged to say, you know, I know when he started his business, he was at zero, but we uh, we quickly got him to 30,000. He got his th first 30,000 work. I said, okay, let's triple the goal. Let's go to 90. And he was a little bit, a little bit concerned about that. But we we put a focus in it and we got him to 90 and within a few months he's at 90,000. And so now he's excited and he's messaging me like, cause he remembers that he wasn't just sure he could do it and now he's done it. And now he's already thinking about how he can make 180. Now I take a copy of those messages. When I get those messages, those emails or those text messages to say, great, I've had this success, I've had this result. I take a screenshot of them. And I save them uh, into electronic folder. Uh, I save into Evernote where I can go in and see that. I can go in there at any point now and I can click on, you know, um, client loving. So the great things that clients have said about me and I can read that. Now, why? Why is that interesting to you? I don't just want this to be like a breakfast, like, hey, I'm great. My clients say, say nice things about me. I, I want this for you. Your clients are going to be saying nice things about you. They're going to be happy with the result that you've got them or the things that you've done. And I'm going to encourage you to keep a copy of them. Now, I keep them electronically, so I can go in there and see them anytime. Now, why is it important to go in and see them anytime? Is because as you go along your journey, there may be times in the journey where things aren't as easy or things are a little bit more challenging or things aren't really going as well. And it's great to go in there and remind yourself of all the great things, the great work that you're doing. Uh, additionally, it's also great if you have some awesome feedback from people about the work that you're doing to share it with your team, anyone who's involved. Now, I don't have a physical team with me, but I have uh, virtual assistants who work on various elements for me, and it's always valuable to share it with them. Even though there's someone that I've never actually had the privilege of meeting, but we maybe spoke on Skype or message, it's so great to send to them and say, hey, this person's had a, a great impact or a great result because of the work that we've done together. And that really helps them understand their contribution. So reading it back yourself is super important. Um, sharing it with your team is super important. Now, sometimes as well, some of these uh, customer loving, some of this great feedback is appropriate to be shared uh, in, in a setting. Sometimes my clients say great things to me and I ask them to share it into our community, into our Facebook group. And they'll happily do that because it encourages other people in the community. Hey, look at the result that I've got because I've followed through on the actions you can kind of do the same. And, and so this is this is a great thing to share in a group community. Sometimes when clients say great things, it's uh, also easy to ask them, hey, can you give that to me in a LinkedIn recommendation? And they'll go and say those very same things uh, publicly for you. Or they will write it down and say, yes, you can use it as a testimonial. Now, of course, that's, that's super great. We think about the previous episode where we've discussed about social proof, that's immediate social proof. OK, uh, one of my clients uses this very well. So I've been talking about how I keep my um, the great customer loving or the great things that clients say to me. I keep them in a folder so I can read them anytime and share them. One of my clients, or two, two, I've got two examples for you. One of them is my chiropractor. We were there this morning. She has uh, on her wall in her kind of reception area, all of the cards and thank yous that she's received from parents for helping uh, their children with their back or with their, their birth of the child. And so she's got a whole wall of it. Now that's super powerful from a social proof point of view. One, it must be great for her to go in and see on the wall every day the great work that she's done and how people are thankful, but even better for her customers coming in. They realize that they're in the right place when they see so much customer loving. Um, another one of my clients uh, in Brisbane, he also has the same. He, has, uh, he makes kitchens and installs kitchens and he has a whole wall and so when customers come into the showroom to see the kitchens they're probably wired by the standard of work that he has but more importantly they can see this whole wall of great things that people have said about them so 
Okay, uh, what's the summary then? Tip 32 is have a customer loving folder. folder. Whenever anyone says something nice about you or is, uh, is kind about you, keep a copy of it, note it down somewhere, and then you can use that later for yourself or for your team. All right, and I think that's my cue to go. Vasara is waking up, so have yourself a great day, and we'll be back tomorrow for tip 33. Enjoy.